Now this is more, this is more me. Vince, another this Mercedes. Me. This is me. This is uh, an executive, right? This is an executive sled. Is that what they're called? Did you say sled? Sled. Like in, like in, like in, like on a snow sled? No, sled like uh, Sled is like, it sounds like jogging. It's jargon for sedan, I thought. You think so? I, that's what I heard. No, I think that's a derogatory term, actually. I think sled? you've been hanging around call people too much. That's that your problem. Is... I think you ought to hang out with comedians. I think you're funnier <laughs> no. than you are a call man. Is, but is sled, not, is sled really? A, slug, a sled is like a, a bomb. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh. You know what? This is not a sled. This no, is, I thought this... That this was, this no, is like no, a... no, no, no. Take that out of your vocabulary. Take that one out. And when you're going skiing, get a sled. All right. This is an S500. Ooh, ooh. This is... now, now the S stands for what? Doesn't stand for L for luxury. No, I don't know. Good they question. Have, they have C class, they have E class, they have S class. Uh huh. And what does it? What and, does that and, well, first of all, the 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 car itself is a stretched body of the E class, so it's like a super body. Oh, is that is that where yeah. it became? Yeah. And, and the 500 stands for, you put a dot right there. It's a five liter V8. Okay. So the, the numbers mean something with Mercedes. Sometimes they don't for other cars. Oh, I mean, they make them up. I mean, they, I like Mustang, but now they have cars that, that say 23. Or who cares? What the, how about a 9-3 kind of a car? What the heck does that mean? Right. He's got nine doors or he's right. got three cylinders? I have see. no idea. All right, but and when it comes to a Mercedes, the, the it means something. Means it means something. And it's the engine, numbers this, represent the liter size. size of the engine. Liter size. Liter size. So this is a five-liter V8. It's beautiful silver. It's got these nice five-spoke wheels on it. It's got great black leather. This is a really sleek, sleek car. Silver is Mercedes' original racing colors back in the 50s. So, like, you had the British racing green. And, and silver is... You had uh, the silver. Yeah. Was silver's their did, color. That was they, just, Their gold wing was always in silver's. Oh. Not always, but they were. Silver is their, is, silver is their color. All right. Well, this is a 2004. It's only got 41,000 miles on it. Wow. So, long There's a very good chance this is still in the factory warranty also. Because it's, uh, it's four years and less than 50,000 miles. All right. Of course, you got your multi-position power seats. You got you got everything on this car. Yeah, they created all that stuff too. Mercedes. Did. Mercedes created this this little miniature chair. Now you, everybody so copies them. Everybody's copying them. You you could be driving at night and just feel what is the back of the chair, the front of the. You could just feel it with your fingers and move it. You know what's the other th interesting thing that I never knew about Mercedes? What's that? Uh, for a long time, they didn't give you cup holders. Uh, they didn't want you to uh, uh, get in trouble drinking and driving. Is that what it was from? Yeah. I thought it was, had to do with the whole Autobahn. You're supposed to be driving, not having a beverage. Well, I mean, that's what I meant, drinking and driving. Well, well, okay, I was just assuming even a cup of coffee. You're not supposed to be, but... Well, I mean, you're, you're on the Autobahn, you're either drinking beer or you're doing 120 miles an hour. Oh, I got you. All right, so uh, now, again, a car like this, somebody's going to say, why would, it, why would a car like this appeal to me? What, why would I come to a car connection to get this? Well, I used to sell Mercedes here in Atlanta, and, and I can tell you this car is, is well below the market price compared to what the Mercedes dealers want for a car like this. Mm -hmm. uh, you want to save three to $5,000? You need to come and see me. Okay. 